Okay Theta is located few kilometers south of Khobabis. This is the grave site, which is home to many Ovambandero leaders, including Guvauva, who is regarded as a hero of the Ovambandero community. The gathering started with the performance of traditional rituals to introduce the pilgrims to these ancestors buried at the site. Ovambandero chief Kiles Karairoa Munyuku III in Guvauva addressed the gathering. The general attendance, I'm very much happy, because it's not always, each and every year, that you are having a lot of people, more than 5,000, more than 3,000. So sometimes there are problems, funerals, but the one of today, I'm very much happy. Parade by ground troops of the Green and Red Flags regiments marked the day. The event also coincided with the chief's birthday, which was well observed. Chief Ngoova says such commemorations serve as a platform to educate young people about their culture and history. It serves the purpose, so they are informed what happened in the past. They are informed also concerning our dances, traditional dances, so they have to learn about that. So they serve the purpose, and on the other side, we are keeping on our tradition and our culture also. In a speech read on his behalf, Omaheke Governor Festus Waitele says such gatherings should be used to foster unity among the community. For the honors and challenges on our traditional leaders, to strive towards unity, prosperity of their communities, and the rest will follow. I'm very much aware that the challenges are, are many that you are facing and that your people are also facing, but they are not impossible to overcome. A member of the technical committee on the Namibian negotiating team informed the gathering the repatriation of skulls from Germany will include seeking for the sacred belt of late chief Kahimi Mangovova Hendrik Vedboy's Bible and Lotta von Trotter's Diary. Jeff Tashihumino, NBC News, Benduk.